wonderful to be here today. His Excellency, the President Muhammad Bukhari, President of uh, the Federal Republic of Nigeria, namely represented by His Excellency, the Minister of Trade and Investment, His Excellency, the Deputy President, His Excellency, Senator Tijani, uh, Managing Director and CEO of Oil and Gas Free Zone Authority, Professor Adis Oji, my brother, Managing Director and CEO of NEBSA, Dr. Nabil Saleh, President of NEZA, Mr. Tawin Izak, Executive Secretary, thank you very much for allowing us to share with you our gratitude and uh, uh, our great honor to be, uh, to be here today. So, uh, Dr. Adi, Adi, Professor Adesoji mentioned that uh, uh, we, we, uh, people are coming from Ghana, people are coming from, uh, from Morocco, but uh, we are having more than 35 countries represented today and tomorrow we will have much more. So it's a great honor for us to be here. Uh, we have delegates coming from different parts of Africa, South Sudan, Lesotho, Eswatini, of course, Ethiopia, South, South, South Africa, and we have also uh, delegates and experts coming from uh, Europe, Mr. Richard Baldwin coming from Geneva. We have people coming from US, from Germany. So today, Nigeria is definitely the mecca of the special economic zones. So I'm uh, very delighted to be here with you today, celebrating the 30th anniversary of the SEZ scheme in Nigeria. This is an important milestone that allow us today to reflect on the lessons learned and paving the way for the future. As a forerunner for SEZ in Western African region, Nigeria has demonstrated the importance and the role of its SEZ and free zone in driving national industrialization agenda, supporting economic and social growth, and contributing to better lives of our Nigerian sisters and brothers. The road hasn't always been easy, but in the past three decades, Nigeria, Nigeria's SEZ witnessed a great achievement, finding solutions and driving innovation and charge at a larger scale. As we celebrate this great momentum, there are a lot of lessons that the countries represented here can take from the Nigeria's experience. With our continent that's still reeling from the COVID-19 pandemic and the current crisis, the SEZs remain one of the best devices to help rethinking the economic models in attracting quality investment, promoting industrial upgrading, and creating job and business opportunities. And fort fortune favors the bold. So Nigerian SEZ has been looking beyond the industry of today into the industry of the future. They are now involved in developing plans and capacities to compete in the smartest industry and be connected to the global value chain. I'm taking also this opportunity to comment on the Nigerian SEZ forward looking in attracting substantial foreign and domestic investment along with building strong fundamental for a sustainable development activities such as healthcare, mining, technology, agriculture, and much, uh, m uh, m much more. Nigerian SEZ has embodied the mantra, Naija no dai kari last. I hope that I spell it well. So congratulations for all these great achievements and happy birthday to all of you. Thank you so much.